What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. We about to get into So Real Tea. Regine responds, G5 rumors. Uh, ah, let's get it. What is up, So Real gang? How are we doing today? Chill. I know I've been gone for a little while, <sighs> but I'm back now. Let's get into the video. Well, guys, last night, it seems like Amar and Maya may have been throwing subs at each other again. Amar took to Twitter and stated, First, he stated, If you think any of your options are better fit for you than me, by all means, go there. You know them tables gonna turn. I peep everything. I do everything for everybody. What they gonna do for me? Then he stated, Somebody was trying to do something for you and you used them. <laughs> Y'all itches be dating for help not love then he shares Damn. a photo that states i'm just a girl equals i'm not handling the shit i'm supposed to be handling gonna be 40 plus waiting on a ninja to come save and then he stated i still be showing love even though my heart cracked then he stated i ain't stressing about nothing no more whatever don't go right just ain't meant for me i'm guessing maya had enough because then maya took to twitter and stated don't let bad vibes scare the good energy away. You could be in my face and still can't see me. Then Damn. she posted a tweet that stated, I keep hearing, you're too nice. You're better than me. Because I would have. But as I got older, I realized that God gave me the gift of kindness and forgiveness to use it. Not to dim it. I never had, That's real. had to stop being who I was. I just needed to learn who to stop giving that energy to. Then now that's a fact. Yeah, I've tried my best. That's a lie. I was about to say I've tried my best to change my heart. No, I haven't. I wanted to. And it was like, God damn. Why? But uh, yeah, definitely giving giving your heart to the wrong people. Nah. But when you stop and you start giving it to the right people, you get different results. That's a fact. She shared another post that stated, we grown. Don't nobody want no lying ass ninja no more. Y'all played the F out. Right. She reposted two more tweets that stated, learned how to enjoy my own company because people are weird. Another Back. post that stated, biggest turn off, that lying shit. Right after that, she tweeted F you and F that. Here. At this time, Amar was still going off on Twitter. Maya shared another post that stated, sneak dissing never phase me. You already showed me you weak as F by not being direct. Damn. LOL. I be staying to myself. Fake shit. I ain't into that. A he love that girl. I don't know why he won't just stay with him. A little while after that, Amar tweeted, these hoes don't be having shit going on. She shared another post that stated, People say F you in different ways. You just got to pay attention. It's no such thing as real love anymore. Everybody is full of lust. Right after that, Amar took to Twitter and stated, Please don't associate me with no itch. These y'all itches. Y'all, then he shared a post that stated, You itch me, please. After that, Maya tweeted and stated, I don't take disrespect lightly. You're going to have to stand on that pool. But y'all comment down. Really make them stand on it because you play too much. Below and let us know what you think. Do you think Amara and Maya are back beefing with each other after recently trying to rekindle? Or do you think that they're just tweeting random things and this have nothing to do with each other? I don't really know. And I can't really tell. But it just be very ironic. But next. Well, guys, on the other hand, I know you guys have been seeing India and Jazz spending a lot more time together. Jazz took to Twitter this morning and stated, I sleep good at night, not giving a F what nobody else got going on. And then India took to Twitter Facts. this morning and stated, Reassurance means a lot to a person who overthink. Comment down below, guys, and let us know. India took to Twitter last night and stated, Disappearing with my person and having our way. And then she reposted a post from Zavo that said, value me or I'm done. Then she also made a post that stated, I date to be together for life. Welcome to death row. Damn. Comment down below, guys, and let us know what you think. It's good to see that even though Maya and Amar are going through whatever they're going through, India and Jazz are not allowing that to stop what they have going on. That is very mature of them. Jazz don't give me that. She give me that ain't got nothing to do with me. Comment down below. That's a Libra thing to do. So let us know what would you do. Would you be able to remain in a relationship with someone that you met through your best friend, even though her and her man is not together anymore? I don't see why not, but I know some people have certain type of codes. So comment down below and let us know what would you do.
let's get into Regine. Yesterday, the tea room posted that Regine and G5 may be back dealing with each other. They were both spotted out in the same area. For those of you that don't recall, G5 and Regine just recently broke up. And he had went back to his ex-girlfriend. He even took her on vacation for her birthday. And then right after that, he even took to Instagram and cleared the air about what happened with him and Regine. He stated that he did wrong and she had left him. But guys, comment down below and let us know. Do you believe Regine went back? She took to Twitter this morning and stated it never gave that. I ain't gonna lie, they do look like they're in the same... No, they don't. <laughs> Hold on. This is brown, not red. Maybe a filter makes it look red, technically, and yes, it is the same. But where are these? Y'all can't see my mouse. I hate when that happens. Ah. What do you think she could be talking about? A lot of speculations are going around saying that she stole g5 from one of her hairstylists Hair comment down says, below and let us know what print. you think <laughs> i don't think she stole anyone maybe she didn't know they were talking but the world is so small guys it's it's so crazy who knows who and sometimes people don't even know the people you may know until you guys start getting to know each other yeah, Regine carter just took to twitter and stated I'm usually the get a new one, buy my own, do it my own type of person. Never clocked what someone else had or was doing and wanted to do it or have it. Just not my vibe. If you know me, you know that. Hmm. Comment down below, guys, and let me know what you think. Sound like she ain't want nobody else, man. <laughs> Why you got on the hat? Put my wig. Who is this? It's so hot, my wig came off. Well, it didn't come off, we back. What you eating? Yeah. MD, I'm so high. Uh, you know how, like, I was? Hey, Denise? Yes. This what I'm eating. Hold on. Let me see. Let me wipe this up. Yeah, Y'all, I'm not reacting to this whole thing. Chipotle? Chipotle? Y'all, the kids is addicted. Good, not, a, not that I changed your polling. Good. I made barbacoa the other day. Oh my God. Tastes just like it. <laughs> 444 in the chat. It is on her necklace. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below because I am done with this video. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hey, yeah.